Well, it feels like yesterday, and yet when we reflect back, we've done so much in that time. 40 years, when you say it, it's quick, but 40 years is a, a we've, we've done a lot of skating in that time. The first thing after we'd won the Olympics, we were invited to come and do a tour here in Australia, and we came down for two weeks, and we ended up staying for three months of doing over a hundred shows. And then we put our first skating tour together down here as well. And so I think we were embraced by the public in Australia. And coming back, it's again, like 50 is a full circle. This is sort of a, a circle end for us as well. We've been together so long, we don't even have to talk about something before we suddenly were having the same thought. When we performed the Bolero um, during that season, we never knew that people would still be talking about it or indeed we will be performing it. Um, it is just incredible to think of that and you know we find it very endearing that people still want to see it so it yeah who knew at the time. You know 50 it's a long time it's a nice round number as well so I think 50 years of skating together it has a ring about it and for us I think our bodies are telling us that we're getting close and so whilst we still can, that's why we really want to still do the tour. Because we've never stopped, you know, and we've always looked after ourselves as much as we can. We've obviously picked up injuries along the way because we've been performing so much. But I think we've been lucky that, you know, nothing has, has been so bad that we can't skate anymore. You know, we've always managed to overcome that. So we're really happy to say that this is going to be our final tour. Um, we feel ready at that point we can still skate to a standard that we're happy with um, and we just like to go out with uh, less final celebration.